Hello HHS, I'm your host Tommy Nation, here with yet another episode of HHS Today. We have a very interesting episode today with a lot of great content. To start, we paid a visit to the senior Halloween costume party to see what was going on. The most engaged costume, Dr. Seuss. The scariest costume. I very rarely get afraid of anybody, but she's definitely <laughs> frightening me right now. Next up is best overall single or duo. Ah! Alright. Most original Tree Gamers Club Group, the Piggy Eyes. Most original Tree Gamers Live Group, Fast Food. Funniest costume, Pumpkinhead. Best overall small group. The Barbies! The best overall large group. TSA. Hey. Yeah. Right, you're good. <laughs> wow, lots of great costumes there. Moving on, we have everyone's favorite segment, question of the day. Today, we asked, what superpower would you have, and what would you do with it? So, I don't really think I want a superpower, um, specifically because when I was little, I used to love to try and jump off my couch over and over again to practice flying, and I knew that if I just kept practicing, then I'd really be able to do it. Um, so, you know, I really like the whole practicing part of it, and I don't really just want to, like, be able to fly someday, because, like, half the fun was, like, jumping off the couch over and over again. If I had a superpower, I think it would be flying, so I could travel the world, and uh, probably do my job as a police officer much more effectively. I would be invisible and try to surprise other people basically and um, because it's a fun thing to do, you know. I would be invisible because then I could drive my car and it would look like nobody else is driving. To travel back in time to redo all those failed quizzes. If I had one, I would take all of the victims of human trafficking and get them out of that nightmare and get them into recovery and help them have good lives again. If I could have any superpower, I could go without sleep because the Red Sox won and I am tired, but go Sox. Speed, because I would like to run around and nonstop and just save some people that are falling from the sky, I guess. Well, those answers were pretty super. Next, we have an exclusive look at our very own HHS TV studio and a little insight on what goes into making an episode of HHS today. Of HHS, I'm Declan Herb with this week's, last week's Play of the Game. It's not scrolling. You have to talk. HHS Today, visit us online and check out our review segment in which Ben Wiegowitz looks at the movie Spellbound by Albert Hitchcock. Wait! Have a great day, everybody. Josh, wait. You're what forgetting about Play of the Game. Oh, well. We're definitely that productive all the time here at HHS. Next, we have a Have You Seen This? We noticed that not many of you submitted answers last time. Do you know what's on the line? It's this free, state-of-the-art HCAM copper water bottle for all of your water drinking needs. Do you know where this picture was taken? Email your answer to hhstv at hillers.org for a chance to win. Also, as a reminder, make sure to check out the Diversity Club movie night today at 2 o'clock in the library. Well, they'll be showing the 2015 movie, Oh My Ghostist, about a girl with the ability to see ghosts. One day she gets possessed by a restless spirit, and to find out what happens, come see the movie. That's all for this episode. As usual, head to our website, hhs.today, for an additional segment, where we have James Payshoff with a new segment we like to call Fish Tales. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>